In my series of boring videos entitled The Hot Zone, I trace the origin and growth of a group called Communards. They originally called themselves Communards, and that's a good enough name for me. Uh, these are these are like uh, locusts that take over the world. They are the type of people that run wild in the streets and burn public buildings, kill each other, kill others. They are a fierce bunch of losers from hell. In an ideal world, I would advocate the surgical strike method. This is imaginary, of course, but suppose you had a military force with sophisticated weaponry, and you could target precisely the leaders of the perps. You don't need to break a lot of things and kill a lot of people and make a big mess. You just single them out. There's one. Doink, got him. <laughs> Now let's uh, zoom over to uh, a landmark most of you can recognize, that's Niagara Falls. And you see where it lies in uh, relationship to the primary target, which is uh, Mississauga, in this case near Toronto. And uh, the dude is there vacationing with his lovely new bride, Point. You got him. Okay, now let's go clean up the mess. His little nest of spies and bastards, Point. Boink, boink. You land here in this field, in this parking lot, and uh, put helicopters or whatever, and snatch up the debris, cordon off the area, get the evidence, and return to your base in the middle of nowhere, and eat your lunch. That's the way it would go in the real world, and I hope the Supreme Court will do a similar thing in disqualifying the leader of the Communards, Barack Hussein Barry Sotero Obama whoever the hell he is, and they will clean up the mess, and we will continue on with our lives, fade to black.